excited. And like I told you, I'm not going anywhere else no more in Los Angeles. I'm going back to the store. No improv so- spots? Especially after I shot the Netflix special and everything. It all came to me after that, that 10 years, and especially after she died. You know how people, you ever go to like an acting class and people refer to Stanislavski and all this shit? 10 years from now, people are going to be referring to the Mitzi Shaw technique. There was something that every con- I was talking to Duncan about it. I talked to Ari about it. I know she said something to us at one point that we were like, wow, something. I remember I was telling this on my podcast that there was a time she didn't like you doing that in the cold bit in the yeah, main room. Yeah, she hated it. <laughs> she wouldn't let me do it in, in the, the main, main room. In the main room. Yeah. In the original. How yeah. fucking crazy is that? That's to show you her genius in a way. Like, she was like, Joe, you could light yourself on fire in the original room. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. But in the main room, you can't do that because you're killing my room. Like, the comics afterward just could not follow it. Like, they could just not follow it. That well, lesson was right there. a fucked up bit. The that, bit was about... It was brilliant, but it... Think about it. There's no good versions of that bit anywhere. There's one version that I did that's up on you. It's terrible. It's a terrible version. That, that There's no solid versions of that bit. But that bit was right when that guy died, J. Howard Marshall. <laughs> he died. And it was all about him getting Anna Nicole Smith to do shit to him before he died. <laughs> but the but money. father, she's trying to take <laughs> your money. I don't give a fuck. I want to get my balls licked or something like that. It was like a that. crazy bit. But Mitzi didn't like it, too, because she didn't like bits that were making fun of old people. Because, you know, her health was deteriorating, too. <sighs> She, there was a couple of bits that she didn't like. <laughs> this, is, this fucking picture of him. He's a million years old and she's hot as the sun. And she's sitting on his lap. Look at him. Look at the smile on his face, dog. Yeah, oh man. I loved him. I loved that whole scene. I loved what it was. I loved it because it was so blatant. You know, it was just so blatant. But she didn't like that bit. She didn't like the Hugh Hefner bit either. She didn't like that bit. This was when Hugh Hefner told those, look at it, she's kissing him, oh my Jesus Christ. Oh. He's in a wheelchair while she's marrying him. I mean, it was a damn classic. That, 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 that scene of him and her getting married, she's so young and so hot, and he's so old and wrecked and rich as fuck in a wheelchair. It's such a classic scenario. It was so good. <laughs> you called her a Kentucky Fried Hooker. Yes. <laughs> I had him call her a Kentucky Fried right, Hooker. Right, right. Like, if she, if she wanted that money, she had to do it. But she had to keep doing shit. And then that's, yeah. It's, he's going, Father, he's going. It's and, time. Also, and he it's wakes time. up and he's like, it's time to lick my ball. <laughs> <laughs> it's time. Oh, yeah, man. I, I just love the fact that that guy was that wealthy and yet still. I mean, I guess when you're that wealthy. What was he and that worth old, at that time? More than a billion dollars. Yeah, he was a billionaire. He was an oil magnate. Right? Wasn't he? I don't think she got the money, though. I think the kids fought her. 100 million? What? That's peanuts. Yeah. It got her, dog. Anna Nicole Smith's daughter is now the fourth richest woman in the U.S. Daughter-in-law. It's what? Oh. oh. No, it says $37 billion, though. That's the, that's the Koch oh, brothers. Oh, Koch brothers. Oh, I see, I see. He was, he was 69th on the list. Oh, but fourth richest woman. Do you know out of the richest women in the world, Google the richest women in the world, like where they got their money from? It's rough. It's rough out there, guys. They, they ain't fucking starting businesses. <laughs> They're marrying dummies. <laughs> really? Yes. Is that how they got It's almost rich? all of it is divorce. Almost all of it's divorce money. 